Ryan is going to color the, the side of the tree here, the little branch. What color are you gonna choose? Mm, rainbow. Rainbow, magical, okay. Welcome to Ryan Toy Reveal. Hi guys, today we're making a magical tree. So it's going to make crystals on the tree. Are you ready? What? Let's go. Yeah. This is how you make your magical tree. First, you draw a tree out of cardboard like this. Then you use scissors and cut it out. And the only difference is this one. You make an extra cut here on the top of the tree. See the extra cut? And here you make the cut the bottom of the tree, okay? Whoa. And I actually also made a bigger giant version too. So it's the same one. Same, one cut on top of the tree, one cut on the bottom of the tree. Now, let's put it together. Yeah, so the two where you made a cut, you put them together like that. Look, it's a tree now. Whee! I'm gonna do the giant version now. Whoa, look at the giant tree. Whoa, la, 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 now la, just la, missing la. ornaments for a Christmas tree. Oh yeah, <laughs> but we're gonna use ornaments at that's right. Here are the ingredients we need. First, you're gonna need to get some salt, Miss Stewart's bluing, ammonia, and some water. First, we're gonna need a spoon of all of these. Yeah, so a spoon of salt, a spoon of bluing, and a spoon of water. Whoa. It might get messy, and don't forget, these are chemicals, so you don't eat them. Whoa. And do this experiment with the parent, because like Ryan's spilling everywhere. Oh, oh no, no, no. Oh. All right, so that is salt in there. So we actually don't have a real measuring spoon, so we have to use a regular spoon, but I think it's okay. Since Ryan made a big mess, I'm gonna do this part. So, a spoon of the blue. Oh, you made a mess too. I know, this is bad. This is bad. Spoon of bluing, you guys see it? Ah! Oh, oh you ah! Mommy, you almost got the camera! I made a big mess. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, last one. Let's see if uh, I can do this. A spoon of water. Whoa. Oh my. I know. I, Whoa, it's blue. I know. Alright, so in here. Then Ryan's gonna agitate and stir it. Let's agitate. Do, 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 do. Last thing we need is half a spoon of clear ammonia. Oh, uh, can you do this, Mommy? This looks like I'm gonna spill a lot. True. <laughs> Mommy's gonna attempt the ammonia. Mommy. Oh no. <laughs> I spilled again. Oh, do you see something? I spilled again, you guys. Alright. There you go. Oh no, I did one spoon. Uh, uh, <laughs> it's okay. Next, let's color the tree. Yeah, I got some colors here to choose from. So basically, Ryan is going to color the the side of the tree here, the little branch. Whatever color Ryan shows, the crystal will grow that color. So, what color are you gonna choose? Mm, rainbow. Rainbow, magical. Okay. So Ryan's just putting color on the side branch. To that side green. I'm gonna use blue now. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right, next, we're gonna use yellow. Ooh. Whoa, yellow, yellow. Next, I'm gonna use red. Oh, yeah. Now, put the tree here and pour this on top. Mm. Oh, yeah. Now, we just have to wait 10 to 12 hours. Okay. Yeah, but then we're actually gonna make this giant version too for you guys to see, okay? Yeah! So we got our bigger tree here, also colored it, many different colors. See, Whee. La, 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 la. We got our bigger version of mixed chemicals. Now we're gonna pour it onto the tree. Oh, Ryan, I'm definitely gonna spill. This is definitely gonna spill. Whoa. Okay, I'm just making a mess, you guys. Now, what's gonna happen overnight, so we have to wait like eight to 10 hours overnight, and then we'll see our magical trees, and then I will tell you what happened and how does it work, okay? We're gonna go home, go to bed, and come back. All right, there you go, let's go. It's been about one day. You ready to see what it looks like? Mm -hmm. Okay, open your eyes. 
you guys notice here what happened? It's all dried up. We didn't even have enough to make the full tree. See, but this one looks kind of cool. You see, Ryan? So there it is, it's been three days. You guys noticed here the salt. So it dried up. That means we didn't put enough water in there, Ryan. <laughs> but this one looks pretty good. See, the part that did have it, it came out really well. We just should have put more water and ammonia and stuff, but it's okay. Whoa. So next time if you guys do the experiment, just make sure you make more than you need, right? Yeah, you do. Yeah. yeah. So thank you for watching our video. Hope you enjoy our video. Bye. Bye. Stay happy and rise up. Nice. Hi guys, today we're doing a science experiment with cereal. Did you know cereal had actually have the iron inside? So we eat nails for breakfast? Uh, here's our new cereal. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah, we don't actually have nails at our breakfast, but we do have iron in our, our breakfast cereal. So if you look on the side and it says 25%. So that means that if you eat one serving of the cereal, that you completed 25% of iron that you're supposed to eat for the day. So we're supposed to be 100% of iron? Yeah, you know why iron is important, Ryan? Why? Iron helps transport oxygen all over your body. Ah, the red blood cells. And why do you need oxygen? Uh, to breathe. Iron also helps your body get rid of carbon dioxide. Do you know who needs carbon dioxide to survive? Plants. Exactly. Carbon dioxide is coming out of my mouth. <sighs> <laughs> Are you ready to test? Oh, yeah and find iron in your cereal boxes? Voila, voila. And you know how we're gonna test? How? Nails. Magnets. Magnet, that's Dang. right. Oh, oh, take, can a you take one? Ugh, take a magnet. Oh. You can pick up things that are metal with magnets. For example, let's see if you can pick up those nails. Oh no. Zip. Yeah. I'm not holding it. Zip. Ooh, whoa, 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 look at that. Here's some other things that are metal, like your batteries. Wow. batteries. So it's fun just to go around the house with a magnet and see which one's metal. I like all the tools. Oh. Whoa. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Would a magnet pick up this wooden spoon? No. Pick it up? No. No, it just falls. Are you ready to see if there's iron in your cereal? Yeah. Which cereal you want to try? Lucky Charms. Lucky Charms Ooh, it lucky is. Lucky Charms. Oh. Mm. Let me test one thing. Mm. The magnet here you can try, but it doesn't pick up the flakes. You know, other things are dissolved into this flake. But we're gonna have to mix it together with water. We actually gotta smash it, okay? Three, two, one. This is fun. Ah. Ta-da! <laughs> oh, Ryan's eating it. Um, good iron. And now I'm gonna pour this into the Ziploc. Looks cool. I'm gonna try <laughs> not to spill it. Sorry if I get on your hand, Ryan. Good. Zip it up. So now we have our bag here, so we're gonna just mix it and dissolve it. Cool. And we're gonna wait about one hour, and then we can test for iron. Mm. Guys, it's been one hour. And while we wait, we actually did another one with Fruit Loops. And then after one hour, there it is. You got your magnet. Magnet. So you actually have to hold the magnet at the bottom. That way, all the magnet can collect together. Do it for like 30 to 20 seconds. And then do you see the iron? Let's see. Whoa! See it? Oh, yeah, I saw it. I saw Whoa. it. Come back. Whoa! Oh. There's iron right there. Whoa, you oh, see yeah. how it moves around? Yeah, you got all the iron to separate. Whoa. Uh, did you see it? No. <laughs> I swear, I saw it. <laughs> Hopefully you guys try this experiment at home and there's actually some cereal that has a lot more than others. I've seen cereal that says like 100% iron. <laughs> yeah, so if you guys try that experiment out, let us know. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye guys, let us know if you try this fun science experiment and let us know what other science experiment we should do. Oh. Bye. Bye. Please click on one of these videos for Ryan Toy Review more fun.